got my first pair of glasses in the first grade. So I've worn glasses or contacts or both for 30 years. My daughter is um, in the choir at our school and I was sitting kind of in the middle of the room. Wasn't really sitting close, wasn't really sitting back, but I couldn't pick her out. That's when I told my husband, I have to do something. I want to be able to see her. I want to know that that's her. So that for me was my turning point. So when I got here for my consultation, they did the exams, they did everything, and sure enough, I was not a candidate for LASIK. Um, he said that I would probably be a good candidate for ICL. I talked with Dr. Luke, he introduced me to Dr. Luke, and Dr. Luke kind of explained what would happen if this is what I chose to do. Um, and then he asked me if I knew what my script was, and I said no. I said, I know it's bad, but I don't know what it is. And he said, it's 23,000. And my husband was like, that's eight and a half football fields. 23,000, that's 3,000 feet is eight and a half football fields. I said, I know what you can see at eight and a half football fields, I can only see at 20 feet. I can see um, for miles, it feels like, when as before, I could see about six inches in front of my face. I'm a teacher, and so for me, I kind of compare it like on my daily tasks. So. Um, like looking at kids down the hall, I can see who they are clearly at the other end of the hall versus I think that you absolutely should check into having this done because it is life changing. Um, I can't describe to you the difference.